So good evening once again, everybody. This is Junior Varsity Basketball right from UDA Gymnasium. Tonight, the Trojans take on these Juniata Indians in the Junior Varsity Ball game. And uh, we'll see how we make out tonight. The last game out, or the last time out, uh, we played uh, Greenwood. And the Junior Varsity lost to the Greenwood Wildcats. Stayed up with them for about half the ball game and then kind of faded away in the last half of the game. So tonight we'll see if we can't do a little bit better. We do have the names available for both squads, and we'll pick these young fellows up as we go along. For UD, the starting five in there includes uh, Jason Nell tonight, along with uh, Wagner. Uh, let's see, Miller. There's a ball tapped out of bounds off UD. It'll be Juniata ball. Nell, Miller, Troutman, Kinch, and um, Wagner in there to begin the ball game tonight for UDA. This is that long. And Long bounces it over here for Lee. Lee for a shot. No good. Rebound on the far side and a foul call. The foul will be on number 25, Halflet. And Halflet picks up his first foul. First foul of the ball game. And the Trojans with their first opportunity to uh, do something with the basketball as Wagner will inbound here for that Corey Troutman. Corey is going to be an outstanding point guard here. And Kinch will walk with it as Ryan tried to dive inside, had it blocked off, and then decided to go a different route and couldn't get that dribble down. So it'll be Long coming back with it here, bouncing it over here for that Lee and into the corner. This is Wagner back outside for Long. Here's Halflet. Inside he goes for Lee. Back outside here for Long for two. No good. Short rebound right there to that Jason Miller. And he'll push it up here for Troutman. Near wing over here for Wagner. Wagner looking for three. A little off the mark. And on the rebound, Nell fires it back here. Tapped around by Long. And Long will control it. Starts back up the court with it. <clears throat> He'll spin it over here for that Lee, and then back to Long. Over there for Halflet. Inside, he tries to push it to that number 55, Goss. But it's tapped out of there by UD. And Wagner will inbound the ball. This is Long with it. Oops, he picks up the dribble. Over here for that Lee. Lee taking it all the way inside on the baseline. He'll pick it up, shoot one for two. It's good. So, uh, Stagger Lee here has got two. <laughs> anyway, and back with it come those uh, UD Trojans. Oh, here's a ball tapped away by Goss, but picked up by UD's uh, Troutman. He puts a shot up, blocked away, and back with it come those Juniat Indians. Here's Long looking for two. He missed the shot, and the rebound comes down there to Nell, and he has it thrown out of bounds off Long, and it will be a UD ball. Played almost two minutes of the first quarter. It's a 2 nothing ball game. Juniata on top. Troutman will take it over in the wing and drop it off the head of Miller, who has it back now. For Wagner. Bouncing it over there for Kinch. Ryan outside here for that Troutman. Corey for Kinch. Ryan will take it inside. Pushes it over here for Miller. Miller looking for two. That's long. Rebound shot by Nell, however, is no good, but he's fouled. And Jason will go to the line, shooting two. Jason Nell at the line, shooting a pair. Here's his first one. It's good. A 2-1 ball game, and Jason can tie it up here if he gets this one in. He did. 2-2. Two -two. 4-42 remaining here in quarter one. Here's Long, working it around out in front. Over in the wing he goes with it now. They'll dump it onto the baseline. Wagner tries to put a shot up, but it's blocked out of there by UD. And uh, Wagner will inbound the ball. We have a Wagner for us, a Wagner for them. This is Goss. Oh, he has the ball tapped away in there. And it's going to go out of bounds off the uh, Indians. And it will be Wagner inbounding. Boy, Aaron making a good play that time to knock that ball loose and off the hands of that young uh, Indian. Here's Wagner on to the corner here for Miller. Jason. Inside he goes here for Kinch. Kinch stopping and popping. It wouldn't go in. And rebound on the far side. Control over there by Nell. Back outside here for Wagner. And Aaron will take it inside. Looking for two. It's blocked away. The foul will be on 
55 Goss here, I believe. And that's going to send Aaron Wagner to the line, shooting two. Foul was on Goss, his first. Wagner's first shot's good. UD three. Junior at two. And Aaron will get to put his second shot in here and double up that margin. His second shot is no good. Nope. Rebound there to Goss. Score remains 3-2. UD by one. Long pushing it over to wing over there. Picked up by uh, Halflet. Inside they go. Goss with a turnaround shot. No good. Nell with a rebound. And Jason will work it up court here. Shoving it over to wing here for Troutman. Corey on the right side there for Jason Nell. Out in front it goes to Wegner. Wegner working it around out in front with Long on him. We're going to call five seconds on Aaron Wegner as Aaron was dribbling around out there and couldn't find anybody or elected not to pass it, whichever, and was called for the five second violation. Here's Long. Long needs help, and he calls for help. He went back court with it. Yeah, he did need help as the pressure pulled on there by that Corey Troutman. Good pressure here by old CT. And uh, Miller inbounding. Here comes Corey, working it down the right side for Nell. Jason will take it to the top of the circle and then throw the ball out of bounds. Here it'll be Juniata ball. We've got three minutes, 15 seconds remaining here in the first quarter. UD ahead, 3-2. Jason Nell checks out of the ball game. That uh, Kyle Bingaman in there for UD. Long over here for uh, Lee. Now back to Long. Now Lee has it, pushes it over in the corner, stolen away in there by Jason Miller, who made a good one-arm stab at it. Knocked it down and gathered it in for UD. Here's Wagner. Near wing over here for Troutman. <clears throat> Corey lost it, but picks it back up here for Wagner for two. His shot wouldn't go, and rebound there for Long. Long back up court with it. Looking for a little help. Bounce it here for Lee. Lee will pick it up and bounce it back to Long. Into the corner it goes. Inside for Goss for two. No good. Rebound. Tapped around in there. And let's see who's going to control it. Halfley had it. Lost it. Picked up in there by Bingaman. Ahead here for Troutman. Troutman for two. It's good. Good job there by Corey Troutman as he and Bingaman combined on the steal. And Corey was able to put it home. Long for Lee. Into the corner for Wagner. Wagner back to Lee. Lee looking for a couple. He's got him. A two-pointer for Mr. Lee. 5 remaining here. 5-4. The homer's on top yet by one. Here comes that uh, Troutman. Pushes it back over here for Wagner. Wagner's looking for a 3-2. All right. And Wagner for two. Nice bucket. Makes it 7-4. And here comes that long fellow. <clears throat> he has it tapped out of there. Say They say it went off the hands of uh, Jason Miller. Not sure if Jason agrees with that or not, but nevertheless, it will be a couple of new ball players coming in here now. Dillman will inbound the ball. He's checking into the ball game, uh, along with a number 30 who does not appear on our list. Obviously, just got him out of the stands. <laughs> anyway, over there is Halfley. Halflet it is. Here's 30, the unknown fella. He puts a shot up, no good. Rebound here for Kinch. Quickly back over here for Corey Troutman. Corey working it around the right side, but Long will step into him and pick up a personal foul. He done shooting. The Trojans will inbound the ball. Troutman getting set with 127 remaining here in the first quarter. Here's Bingaman. Kyle working it out in front. Has the ball passed here for Wagner. Aaron will take it down on the near wing. Pushing it here for Troutman. Troutman bounces it on a nice bounce pass for Kinch for two. It's good. Nice bounce pass from Corey Troutman to that Ryan Kinch. And Ryan put her home. It is 9-4 with a minute and three left here in the first quarter. Here's Long. Bounce pass over here on the wing. This is Dillman. Dropping it there for Long. Long back inside to Dillman. Dillman pumps it once. And they're going to call a foul on Ryan Kinch. 
be non-shooting. And with 52.4 seconds remaining, the uh, Juniata will inbound the ball. Dillman will inbound as uh, Messner comes in there to replace Kinch for UDA. Dillman for that uh, Henry. This is Dillman with it again. Back here for Henry. Henry just into the ball game for the first time. Spins it here for 30. He'll fire it out of there into the cheerleaders. Past Haflett. And it will be UD inbounding. 41 seconds left in the first quarter. They'll spin it over there for Bingaman. Now here is Wagner with it. Wagner taking it inside. Dropping it back over here for Corey Troutman. Oh, nice bounce, or nice pass for Miller. Miller puts the shot up and in good. He's fouled, and Jason will go to line to shoot one to get three. Excellent pass by that Corey Troutman again there, making that sharp pass inside for Jason Miller. And Jason able to put it home. It was fouled, so he'll be shooting one. Jason Nell back into the ball game to replace uh, Aaron Wegner as uh, Miller makes his first and only shot. Gets three out of that, and it's now a 12-4 ball game. Long coming back here for Juniata. Picking up that dribble, back over here for that 30. 30 will spin it around the right side here and pass it to back to Long. Over here for that Dillman. Out front here. Now 30 with it again on the baseline for two. No good. Rebound in there to uh, to uh, Messner. And here's a quick pass ahead here now intended for um, and Jason Nell, but out of Jason's reach. And we've got eight-tenths of a second left. So here's that play. He spins around. He fires one, but it's short. Score at the end of one. The Trojans 12, the visiting Juniata Indians 4. UD is going to have the honor of inbounding the ball to begin period number two. And uh, Wagner back in there now for Troutman. Nell in there also with Kinch and uh, Miller. So this is the starting five, and they're all back in there to begin the second period. Here's Kinch looking to go to the bucket. Puts the shot up and didn't have the ball. Miller with a rebound shot blocked out of there. Wagner fires it back inside here for Miller. Miller has it roll loose. Kinch going after it. The ball is on the floor. Looks like a bowling uh, league starting up here. <laughs> they rolled it all over the floor here. Anyway, on the tie-up, it's going to be Juniata inbounding the ball. This is that Dillman. He will inbound it here for Long. Dillman and Long in here. They have Lee on the right side, and we'll pick up the other guys as we go along. Over there is that Halflet inside for, uh, for uh, Henry with a shot. No good. Corey Troutman coming back with it for UD. Corey will work it in the paint. Dumps it over in the wing over here. Here's Wagner for two. That's a little short rebound. Going to be batted out of there by the Juniata Indians. <clears throat> good call. How can he Somebody questioned the call over there by the bench. I don't know who was the bench, but by the bench, heck, guy knocked it out of there plain as day. Anyway, here's Wagner out in front here for Troutman. Corey swings it over here for Kinch. Ryan will take it inside, pushes one shot up short. Rebound right there to that Dillman. We'll bring it back up here for uh, Lee. Lee picks up the dribble for Long. Across the court it comes here. Now here's Dillman. One fake, one shot, one miss. And a rebound comes down there to Wagner, and he'll start it back up for UD. He'll pick up the dribble, pick up the tempo here. Now as they bounce it right on the baseline, Miller with one good fake. Shot good. He's scored. He's got to go to the line to shoot one again. So Jason Miller looking for two three-point plays here now. Here's Jason Miller. Now he's going to shoot one. And wouldn't go this time. Rebound there for that uh, Halflet. And they say he touched it with the other hand. I got to call that a double dribble. Now, maybe you saw it. I didn't. But he probably did. It wasn't looking. I was trying to check the time. 5.32 left here in the first half. Corey Troutman firing it down here for that Jason Nell. Nell on the baseline is bumped by Wagner. A blocking foul called. And it will be non-shooting, or will it? Let's see. They have six up on the board. Let me see if that was their seventh one. No. 
And the ref is going to talk to the coach. Our coach getting very vociferous over here. And the ref about had enough. He's shouting out at him here, and he, he says, okay. And uh, they say one and one. Yeah, one and one. It is a one and one indeed. So now Nell would go to the line shooting a one and one. Jason Nell shooting a one and one with uh, 5.26 left here in the first half. His first shot and only shot, no good. Rebound on the far side, going to be controlled by Nell. They spin it back out here, tipped around by Lee, but Lee in control of it. Bringing it back up court. He has it tapped away, but picked up over there by that Imes. Into the corner it goes for Halflet. Halflet for two, no good. Return shot by Halflet is good. The shot counts, and he will go the line to shoot one to get three. Foul was on Ryan Kinch, his uh, second. And Halflet shooting one, and he missed that one. And Nell with a rebound over here for Troutman. Quick pass up here for Wagner. Wagner will take it inside, pushes the shot up, and they're going to call a charging foul on Aaron Wagner as a young uh, Juniata ball player had position that time. And Aaron tried to run over him and perhaps draw a foul, and he did, if only it was on him. <laughs> Here's Imes with it. Imes will loop it ahead here now, and the ball comes loose, picked up in there by Miller, who will give it to Wegner. Wegner over here for Kinch. Kinch inside, he goes with it, puts a shot up, no good. Return shot by Miller is no good. And on the return shot by, uh, let's see, by, by uh, Jason now wouldn't go, but then Kinch taps the rebound up and put it in. And we're going to have a foul on Wagner, I believe. Yeah, Wagner picks up the foul for UDA. That'll be his uh, second. Team's fourth. And uh, that Harlan into the ballgame, number 43, Harlan, inbounding it here for Lee. Lee picks it up over here for Imes. Imes with it. Bounce it over here, but it's going to be stolen away by Wegner. Wegner coming back all the way with it. Puts the shot up. He is hammered to the floor. And number 12, Imes, will pick up the personal foul. And Aaron's going to be okay. He really got nailed, but he'll be okay. He'll go to the line shooting two. Here's Wegner's first shot. It's perfect. Went in very nicely. 17, 6, 420 left. Second shot is no good. Rebound comes down there to that Harlan. And he'll push it ahead here now for uh, Long. Harlan into the corner. He goes to Halflet. And Halflet is going to be fouled. And that will be on Aaron Wegner. And Aaron's going to pick up his third. So he'll probably be checking out of here shortly. We'll see. Yeah, Wegner just picked up his third. And the inbound pass is going to be knocked out of bounds over there, so it will be mishandled by Juniata. It will be uh, UD inbounding the ball, and out goes <laughs> Aaron Wagner just checked out of the ball game as uh, Kyle Bingaman back in there for UD. Four minutes remaining in the half. Corey Troutman. Near wing over here for Bingaman. Bingaman takes it out in front almost and then spins it there for Nell. Inside to Kinch, looping it here for Bingaman. Bingaman racing down the right side over there. He's blocked, and Harlan will pick up a blocking foul and send Kyle Bingaman to the foul line, shooting a one and one for UD. Here's Kyle shooting a one and one. His first one is no good. Rebound there for that Goss, who will drop it over here for. Uh, Long. Long picks up the dribble, pushes it inside there for Goss. On the baseline, it goes to Dillman. Dillman's tied up in there, gets it back out here for Long. Long on the baseline. He picks up the dribble now. He's got double coverage. He can get it back here for Dillman. And Dillman picks it up for Long. Oh, UD defense playing very well here. This is Dillman again. Dillman can't go in with it. Long has it blocked away in there by Corey Troutman. Taps it ahead over there, but he's got to tap it out of bounds. But a good defensive move in there by that Corey Troutman. Making a nice defensive move on it. And it will be Dillman inbounding here for Long for Juniata. 
Juniata down the side, goes long for two. It wouldn't go, but a nice rush, but didn't, didn't go down, and Long has it back again. It was a nice drive by that young fella. There's a push inside here for Dillman. Dillman fakes once, and the shot is going to be blocked out of there, but they're going to say that Ryan Kinch picked up his third personal foul as he got on the arm. Kinch picked up his third, and racing back into the ball game is that uh, Nathan Messner to replace Ryan with 2.53 left here in the first half. Dillman at the line, he'll be shooting two for Juniata. His first shot, good. Here's his second shot. It is good also. 17-8 is the score with 2.53 remaining here in the uh, first half. And UD coming back with it now. 17-8 score. Put off in by nine. Kalman spinning it over there for Messner into the corner. It goes for Nell. Nell has his shot blocked away and picked up in there by Lee, but then uh, Lee walked on the end line, and it will be Troutman inbounding the ball for UD. Here for Nell. Jason stepping up, looking for two. It's a little long. Return shot by Messner. Wouldn't go, and the rebound comes down here to Juniata Long coming up here. On the wing for Lee. Inside they go to Dillman for two. It's good. A nice play that time by Lee inside for this Dillman fella, and he put her home very nicely. And it's 17-10, a seven-point ball game. Here's Miller for two. That's good. Right down the shoot for that Jason Miller. 19-10, 2.05 left here. And oh, here's a wreck out here, and we're going to have a blocking foul called on Jason Miller. That might be a one-and-one. One. Yeah, it is a one-and-one one situation now, and so long will go to the foul line shooting a one-and-one one for Juniata. Jason Miller checks out of the ball game as uh, Todd Drobman in there for the uh, Trojans. Here's Long's first shot. It is good. Todd Peters. Did I, I might have said Todd Drobman. Todd Peters. Okay. Second shot by uh, Long is good. Peters into the ball game for UD. Long pass down here for Nathan, but he walked with it first of all. And it will be uh, Juniata ball. Dillman will inbound the ball with two minutes remaining in the first half. Over here for Long. Ahead quickly for that uh, Halflet. Halflet picks it up. Pushes it back here for Long. Inside they go with it now for that number 41 Henry. And he has a ball tapped out of his hands. It's going to be UD ball. Good move in there as uh, Corey Troutman along with Messner combined on him. And grab that ball. 150 left in the half. Here's Troutman, play number four, they call. And we'll see what this play looks like. They're winding it here to Peters. Peters takes it across over there for Bingaman. And Bingaman will pick it up, take it out in front for Corey Troutman. Corey bounces it on the wing over there, and another walk will be called on Nathan Troutman as Nathan's starting off a little bit too quickly tonight. They don't want him to handle it and dribble it. They just want him to shoot it. So let's see. He's going to check out the ball game now as Hockenberry will come in for UDA number 50, or 42. Here comes their number 32. This that Lee bouncing it here for Long. Long into the corner with it. Here's Halflet for two. So no good, but a foul call. They're going to call a blocking foul on UD. And Halflet will go to the line, probably shooting two. Gunderman into the ball game. He replaces Peters for UD. Greedy, number 40 into the ball game for Juniata. First shot here by uh, Halflet is no good. <clears throat> and here's a uh, second shot by Halflet. It's good. 19-13. Well, it's a six point ball game as the Trojans just can't seem to shake this team as uh, they've really had the better of the play, but uh, surely, but or slowly, but surely these Indians sneaking up on us, as Indians are wont to do, I guess. And it will be Jason Nell inbounding the ball for UD. Here for that Corey Troutman. 115 left in the uh, first half. Troutman will drop it here for Bingaman. Bingaman, 15-footer, no good. Rebound right there to that 
uh, Juniata, and back comes Long. Long will take it in front, bouncing it over in the wing. Shot from the side over there by Halflet is good for two. And all of a sudden, it's a four-point ball game, 19-15. A quick pass up ahead here now for Bingham and Kyle directs it into the middle, pushes it right there for Hockenberry for two. It's good. Beautiful pass by Kyle Bingham to this number 42 Hockenberry. And in the meantime, we have a foul called on the other end of the court. And um, it'll be someone down here shooting a one and one. It was on Kyle Bingham in his first and long to the line shooting a one and one. His first, no good. Rebound comes down here to Jason Nell, stolen away by Long. Fires it back out in front here for that uh, Henry, and Henry missed the shot. Back comes Gunderman with it, picking up the dribble on the right wing for Corey Troutman out in front. 26 seconds left here in the half. Going to hand it here for Gunderman, and he has the ball popped out of there. It's going to be uh, Juniata ball, and Juniata can get to within four again here with a bucket as Lee will check in to replace Long for Juniata. Dillman inbounding it here for Lee. Lee ahead here for that 30 and we just do not have a name for that young fella. There's a ball on the wing down here for Dillman. His shot for two wouldn't go. Rebound comes down to Gunderman who went up nicely to make that uh, rebound over there for Bingaman. Bingaman on the uh, end line down there just about lost it. Here's a shot. That would have gone and had been good had it gone but didn't go and so we have a five or a six point ball game here at halftime. It's the Trojans 21 and Juniata 15. Okay, the teams are back for the second half action here as they get ready for uh, play. The Juniata Indians have the ball inbounding that thing here for Long. Over there in the corner to that Wagner. Wagner back for a Long. It's Long and Wagner in there along with Halflet. Uh, Lee, who has it now, back to Long. And the fifth guy in there is that Goss. Here's a nice shot put up and in by uh, number 21 Long. Another good rush by that young fella. And this time he made it go down. And here comes Corey Troutman back for UD. It's, it's the starting five for Upper Dolphin in there. Here's Kinch with it. Kinch puts a 15-foot shot up off the glass and in. Good. Nice bucket there by that uh, Ryan Kinch. Good job. 23-17. Here comes Long with it for Juniata. Has it tapped loose. Picks it back up. Over there for Wagner. Wagner takes it inside. Jumps it back here for Long. Now back to Wagner. He goes on the baseline with it. Stopped. Pushes it out in front. Lee for two. Little short. Rebound to Nell. For Miller. It's uh, Troutman, Nell, Miller, Wagner, and Kinch. This is Kinch with it down in the corner. Inside of rolls here for Wagner. Wagner will take it right up for two. Has it blocked away nicely by Goss. And back comes Lee with it for Juniata with a bounce pass over the wing off the leg of Corey Troutman. And it will be Juniata inbounding the ball on the leg kick ball, whatever. Wagner will inbound for the Indians. This is Lee. On the baseline he goes, and wait a minute, a foul. Blocking foul called on Nell. And it'll be none shooting. Juniata will inbound the ball. Juniata will inbound the ball for the Indians. Here for that Goss. Back outside here for a pass from Long over there to uh, Halflet. But his uh, dribble rolls loose and picked up in there by UD. Back comes that Corey Troutman. Corey pushing it inside. It goes off a foot on this end of the court. And so UD will inbound the ball. Corey Troutman inbounding for the Trojans here for Miller. Miller for two. In and out. Wouldn't stay down. And back with it comes Long with a rush for Juniata. Taking it all the way to the hoop. Puts the shot up a little short. Miller with a rebound for Kinch. Across the court it comes here now for Nell. Jason looping it inside for Kinch. His ball is going to roll over on the end line and be... Junior had a ball because out of bounds off UD. Wagner inbounding here for Long with Corey Troutman on Mr. Long here. Ooh, and there's a ball stolen away by Corey. Nice play as he got a quick hand on that one. 
and stole it away. Over in the corner, they loop it for Nell, who drops it back to Wagner. Wagner for two. It's good. Aaron Wagner for two on a nice shot from over on that left baseline. In the meantime, long with it for Lee. Dropping it there for a shot by Halflett. A little bit off the mark. Return shot by Wagner. Blocked away. Return shot by Halflett is no good. He's fouled. He'll go to the line this time shooting, too. The foul was on number 44, Ryan Kinch, and number 54 there, uh, Nathan uh, Messner, into the ball game to replace Ryan as he picked up personal foul number four with uh, 431 left here in the third. First shot by Halflett is good. And here's Halflett's second shot. And it is no good. Rebound, let's see. Comes down and picked up by Jason Nell. Nell coming back with it with a rush. Pushes the shot up. Wouldn't go down. Rebound comes down there to that long. He fights for it, but they're going to have a foul call. The foul will be on Jason Nell. And uh, Juniata will inbound the ball. Long coming back now for Juniata. 25-18, UD by 7. Here's Halflett. Gets tied up, so he gets it back here for Long. Hello, here's another kick ball. Boy, look at this one going all the way up through the <laughs> superstructure of the uh, bank board. And uh, on the inbound pass here for Dillman, it's Halflett with it. He'll pass it back court. And backcourt is the call as Mr. Long chases it down, but it'll be backcourt and the Trojans will inbound the ball. Jason Miller will inbound for UD. He'll be inbounding here probably to uh, Wagner. Yep. Aaron Wagner starts it down the court here for Troutman. Troutman pushes over in the wing. Shot from the side by Messner. Wouldn't go. Rebound comes back here. Messner's got it. He fires a second shot up. No good. Rebound over there controlled by Henry. Whoa, hold it. They're going to have a jump called as Imes and uh, Aaron Wagner collide over there. And it will be UD inbounding. It's a shot by Miller from the side. No good. Rebound. Let's see. Controlled here to Troutman. Back outside for Nell. Back over here for Troutman. Troutman on the baseline. Puts the shot up and it wouldn't go down. Halflet with the rebound for Juniata. So uh, the Trojans waiting here at the moment as the lid is temporarily on the bucket. It's a shot by Imes for three. It's good. So Imes, who just entered the ball game, gets three for Juniata. And back comes Wagner for UD. Wagner working it over on the baseline there for Messner. He'll pick it up and get it back here for Corey Troutman. Corey will try to take it down the paint. Pushes it over on the wing instead for Miller. For two, it's good. Jason Miller with a nice bucket. And uh, Trojans now lead 27-21. Halflet for three. No good. Rebound comes right back here to Wegner. And Wegner coming back with it. Puts a shot up. No good. And it's going to go out of bounds off the block of Juniata. So UD will inbound the ball. 2.38 left here in the third quarter. The Trojans up by six, which was their halftime lead. That number 30 is Harmon. So number 30, I was told, is Harmon. He's in the ball game now for Juniata. Played a good first half. Shot from the side by Wegner is good for two. Nice shot by that Aaron Wegner. 29-21 now. UD by eight. This is Harmon. Inside, they go with it to Henry. Now over here for that uh, Halflet. And a tied up. Tied up inside there as uh, Corey Traubman. Tied up Halflet with it. And Dillman will inbound the ball for Juniata. Harlan, number 43, back in there for the Indians. Here's Dillman inbounding here for uh, a pass, but it's taken away. Pass down here for Wagner, and Imes will pick up the foul before the shot. Are they going to call it good? Wait a minute. Are they going to say that shot was good? I think this guy sort of signaled like it was. Yep, with a push. No. 
No, he wasn't signaling the back bucket was good. He was signaling the sauce to inbound. <laughs> I didn't think the shot uh, or the foul occurred during the shot. Anyway, here comes Troutman over there for Wagner. Wagner on the baseline goes the first one up. It's blocked away. Imes had a hand on it. Now he tries to reach in and get another hand on it. Here's Wagner still looking for two. Wouldn't go. Return shot in there by uh, Bester is good. So Nathan Bester gets himself two. It's now a 10-point margin, 31 to uh, 21. Here's Imes stepping inside, looking for two. Wouldn't go. And on the rebound, let's see, going to be controlled in there by uh, Imes, who pops another shot up and in. Good. So Imes has at least five, a three and a two now. And here comes that Wegner. Minute and a half remaining, less than that now. Here in the third period, Wegner looking for two, puts the shot up, it's blocked out of there. Harmon got a hand on it and blocked it out of there for Juniata. And so UD will inbound the ball. Corey Troutman inbound with a minute 23 seconds remaining. As Wegner will check out, um, Kyle Bingaman back into the ball game for UD. Over here for Miller. Miller looking for a couple. No good. Rebound comes down here to that Harlan. Harlan will push it ahead here now for Harmon. Harlan. Oh, right here for Corey Traubin. Corey will take it. Let's look, oh, look up for two. Nope, no good. Return shot by uh, Messner is no good, but his return shot, then he's fouled, and he'll go to the line shooting to Nathan at the line to shoot a pair for UD. Nathan Messner puts his first shot up and in. I think I've missed Nathan about twice. They, the ref gives him the ball sometimes. He just takes it and shoots it up. Well, that one was short. So he made one out of two. 32-23, nine-point ball game. 104 left in the third. Harmon bringing it up court here for Juniata. Picks up the dribble, has it knocked out of there. Corey with a steal ahead for Bingaman. Bingaman looking for two. It is no good. And on the return shot, it's going to go knocked out of bounds there off Messner. Some of the Trojan crowd thought there might have been a foul on that, but uh, UD will just get to inbound the ball. Miller checking back into the ball game for UD. No, I guess he was. No, he didn't check back in. I don't believe he was out. I'm not sure. At any rate, here's Troutman back outside here for Bingaman for three. It's good. Kyle Bingaman gets a three. Way to go, Kyle. 35-23, UD by 12. Probably the biggest margin of the ball game, I would think. Oh, here's a reach-in foul called on Corey Troutman. And it'll be non-shooting. Corey will pick up his third, I think. No, actually, Corey, according to the scorekeeper, picked up his first. I had Corey down for a couple of other ones, but his first. Okay, good job. Less than 30 seconds remaining in the third period. Yeah, first first foul on Corey Troutman. Man, that's great. Here's Wagner spinning it over there for a shot by Imes for two. No good. Rebound coming down here to Dillman. Dillman pushes a shot up. No good. Rebound up. Imes, he puts a shot up. No good. And on the rebound, Messner's got it. Over here for Nell. Nell quickly over here for Troutman. Troutman dumping it on the baseline. Shot by uh, Messner is good. Nice pass by Corey Troutman to Nathan Messner. And uh, that did it. Here's a shot at the buzzer. That was off the rim, but no good. So the score at the end of three now. The Trojans have opened up a 14-point margin. It's 37-23 UD. Never get a chance to look at these cheerleaders. And as I said before, these are a great, great group. They're, this is their welcome thing. The only thing we get to see here at UDA. Otherwise, we see the uh, backs of these young ladies. But, boy, this is uh, one group which uh, their leader over there is very, very proud of. Uh, and they <laughs> do a great job every ball game. Win, lose, or draw. They're out there cheering their little heads off. And so... Jason uh, Miller now will inbound the ball to begin the final quarter with the Trojans leading by 14. Here's Wagner out in front. Lee guarding him. They'll push it in here for 
Travitz, who was in the ballgame for the first time. Shot by Wagner, wouldn't go. Rebound goes right over there to Miller. He puts a shot off the glass, no good. Rebound to Lee. Quickly he tries to outlet it over here, but it's going to be stolen away by Corey Troutman. As Troutman dumps it here for Kinch. Kinch lining up for two. It's good. Ryan Kinch gets himself two. Good job. 39-23. Trojans uh, beginning to shake these Indians, but boy, it wasn't easy. As Lee has it into the corner. This is Halflet back for Lee. Lee passing it underneath, intended for Dillman, but out of his reach. And it'll be UD ball. Wagner to inbound. Corey Troutman, he picks it up, fires it down here for Kinch. Kinch will loop it over there for Travitz for two, it's good. Kinch to Todd Travitz and the big guy who just entered the ball game gets two. Coach Seve saving him for the varsity ball game tonight. Todd only seeing a little action here. The game warmed up, I guess, for varsity play. There's a kickball called on Corey uh, Troutman. And it's going to be Dillman inbounding the ball for Juniata. This is long. Outside here for that stagger Lee. Here's Lee with it, picking it up, getting it back over here for long, long dumping it on the baseline for Dillman. And Dillman picked in up the dribble. Back out here for Lee. Lee for two. Wouldn't go. Rebound to Miller. Jason Miller with a good rebound here for Wagner. And Aaron dumps it on the baseline for uh, shot by Todd Travitz, but he is blocked and the shot knocked out of there by Juniata. It will be Corey Troutman inbounding. Travitz says that one pushed out of there. Or did he lose it? No, I guess he lost it. And it will be um, Dillman inbounding for UD, or for uh, Juniata. <clears throat> Five and a half minutes left in the ball game. Trojans now up by 18. Surely the largest margin of the ball game for sure. There's a pass into the corner here for Dillman. Right in front it goes to Lee. Lee's shot blocked away by Travitz. Picked up in there on the bounce pass by Troutman. And ahead here he comes to Kinch. And then over to uh, Travitz for two. Nice passing by these two guys. Kinch to uh, Travitz with an initial pass set up there by Corey Troutman. Here's another steal. Oh, they're going to call a foul. Corey will pick up his second as he tries to get inside there and pick that ball off. Timeout called by the uh, Juniata Indians with exactly five minutes remaining in the ball game. Trojans up by 20. Okay, Juniata gets the ball back following their timeout. They spin it ahead here for Dillman. Long over there for Lee. Back to Long. Back to Lee. Inside it goes. Now on the wing. Shot from the side over there by that Halflet. No good. Rebound controlled here by UD. Wagner has it. Quick outlet up here for Bingaman. No good. Threw it too far. Kyle couldn't possibly catch up to that one. And it will be Juniata inbounding the ball. Here comes that long fellow. He'll stop for Lee. Lee tries to bounce it on the wing over there, and he did for Halflet. And Halflet, uh, or no, actually it's going to be Dillman called for three minutes, lingering in the, or three seconds. It just seemed like three minutes. No, three seconds in the lane, and uh, UD will get the ball. <clears throat> Four and a half minutes remaining in the game. Harmon guarding on the inbound pass here, but it's Wagner with Lee guarding him. Wagner all the way down here, bounces it off a leg, but they're going to call a pushing foul on someone inside. It's going to be on red, 3-2. That's going to be on Lee. He'll pick up the foul, and UD will inbound the ball. For Lee, it was just his first. 421 left in the game, so no problems for him. Here's Travitz for two. It's good. Todd Travitz working his way right around... Um, Henry that time and put the shot in nicely. Here's a ball tipped away by Bingaman, controlled over there, and they're going to call backcourt on Lee. It'll be UD ball as he got the ball out here and then kind of took it forward and then reversed himself and went backcourt. And Wagner, uh, 
Bingaman, or uh, like Gunderman rather, will inbound the ball. Gunderman in here for Bingaman. Near wing, they spin it for Nell. Chasen, 14 footer. It is no good. Rebound comes down in there, and Henry spins it ahead here for uh, Lee. Lee with a bounce pass down here. Here's a uh, shot by um, Harmon, no good. And rebound there for Travitz. Back here for Bingaman. Kyle will call play number four, and he goes on the wing here with it. He picked up the dribble, so he pushes it back here for Gunderman. Gunderman will spin it here for Bingaman. Bingaman looking for something to develop. Keeps hollering four, four. I thought he was playing golf for a second there. No. <laughs> here comes Nell looking for two instead of four, and he's got two of them, and maybe he can get three. The bucket's good. The foul is on Halflet. Halflet can't believe it. He's mad. Anyway, the foul was on that young fella, and... Uh, Jason Nell will go to the line for UD, and he'll be shooting one to get three. It's 47-23. Now the Trojans just rolling along here now. It was six-point differential at halftime. Halflet will check out of the ball game for the uh, Juniat Indians. Here's Nell's one shot. It is no good. Rebound comes down here to Messner. He'll control it back here for Nell. <coughs> Timeout's going to be called by Upper Dauphin. With 3.08 left here in the ball game, Coach Hain calls timeout. Trojans up 47 23. Todd Peters getting set to inbound the ball now. Todd back into the ball game here for UD. This is Bingaman. They've got Hockenberry in there along with Messner and uh, Matier. Here's Bingaman. Only oh, lost the handle on. He got it back again. He's going to take it over and <laughs> try to set something back up again now as he takes it out in front. Better pass it to somebody. Yep, couldn't do it. Got five seconds called on him as he couldn't find anybody to pass it to. And Juniata will inbound. 2.45 left in the ball game. Wagner in here for Harmon. Now they come over the near wing here. Pass it inside. Shot in there by Wagner is good. Oh, he's got two. 47-25. Bingaman coming up court here for UD. For Messner. Messner dropping it back here for Peters. Todd had to go off his hands and back court it goes. And it will be uh, Juniata Ball. Wagner, or uh, rather Messner, checks out of the ball game now as uh, Kunderman, I guess it is, that came back in. <clears throat> Here's Harmon. Near spin, there they spin it over here now, and a shot on the baseline by Wagner. No good. Wagner's got it back again, puts his second try up. It's good. Oh, Wagner's got four points now as he put two in a row in. Minute 55 left. This is Bingaman calling out play number four, and that's going to cause Kunderman to take it out front here and near steal of there. In fact, it is stolen away, and then <laughs> Todd, Todd Peters will hang on to the young fellow trying to break up court. I put a tackle on him out here, and it will be Juniata inbounding the ball as Wagner gets ready to do just that. Imes checks back into the ball game for Juniata. Times along with Harlan in there. Greedy, number 40, is back in. This is Harmon with it. Greedy on the right side. That's Greedy with it now. Here for Harmon. Ball tapped away in there by Peters. Todd still chasing it down, but Harlan picks it up, puts a shot up. No good. Rebound on the far side. Comes down there to Matier. Matier is hung on to by Greedy. Greedy will pick up the personal foul. And uh, no shooting. UD will inbound the ball. Here comes that Kyle Bingaman. Bingaman across the timeline, working it right down the middle, had it come loose. Imes picks it up in there for Juniata. Quickly across the court it goes for another two points by that uh, Wagner. So he's 
been playing pretty well here in the later, latter moments of the ball game. A minute and eight seconds remaining in the game. He's trying to go inside with it. Here is uh, Hockenberry over there for Matier. Matier for two. Wouldn't go. Rebound comes down here to Wagner. We'll jump it ahead here for Imes. Here's Harmon. Near wing over here it goes. Shot by Harlan. I think it is. It's good for two. Well, Harlan has two more. 47-31. 38 seconds left in the game. Bingaman out here in front. Kyle pushes it here for Peters. Todd will take it out here. Oh, and he's fallen upon. No call. Inside they go with it for Matier. Matier pushes it back out here for Peters. Todd checks, tracks it down. He's bumped. Harmon will pick up the foul. And UD will inbound the ball. Bingaman's going to inbound the ball for UD with 19 seconds left in the ball game. This is Gunderman. Gunderman will take it inside. Stop it and pop it. It's good. Nice bucket by Gunderman for the Trojans. Nice shot. 49-31. Here's a shot for three from outside by Harmon. No good. And on the rebound, we're going to have Wagner, Wagner picking up the foul. And Messner going to the foul line for UD, shooting a one and one. Ready this time. When they give that ball here to him, he's ready to shoot. Here he fires that one up. No good. Rebound. Let's see. Controlled here by 40, and that did it. The ball game came to an end. With the final score, the Trojans up by 18. It's 49 UDA, 31 Juniata in the junior varsity ball game. Good job once again. And the Trojan junior varsity back on track. And we'll uh, catch them at the final ball game. Final league ball game, that is, coming up on uh, Tuesday night, I believe it is, up at uh, East Juniata or someplace like that. So uh, congratulations to Coach Hain again. And... Uh, all these JV ball players. See you later. Before we start tonight's game, they are honoring the senior ball players on this squad. Laskowski being the first one. Chad Cucker. Uh, Chad Wagner, Mike Kissinger, Dave Carl, and then Jesse Painter, and finally Aaron Shadle. Senior members of the boys' basketball squad, and they have really done a heck of a job this year, coming up with a about a 17 and 4 record as of this uh, ball game. So, doing an excellent job. Now for starting lineups. Starting lineups coming up. For Juniata, and a guard. Number 13. The Trojans are playing host to the Juniata uh, Indians tonight. Lauver will start the ball game for uh, Juniata along with Bench. Number 11. Number 21 is Steve Deal. He'll be the third starter on the ball club. Jason Beward is the uh, fourth player. And finally, Joel Kreider, the center for the uh, Juniata Indians. Starting lineup for the Trojans tonight in the final ball game here at UDA. The Trojans will play one more ball game at East Juniata and then head into the District 3 playoffs. Senior John Laskowski introduced first as the guard for UD, along with the other senior guard, Aaron Shadle. These guys have started most of the ball games this year. Senior Dave Carl. Also outstanding play this year. Chad Wagner, a senior who's getting a start here of late. And finally, Jesse Painter, another senior who's been only the second year out for Jess, really his first year of playing varsity basketball. And uh, we will be uh, set with the opening tip here in just one moment. The starting five coming on the court for both squads. Tonight, Chad Wegner will get an opportunity to start in place of uh, the injured Sean Rao, who will undergo surgery in, I think, two weeks for a uh, bum knee, which he just suffered the other night against Greenwood in a great effort. Sean was playing extremely well when the injury, freaky kind of an injury, occurred, and uh, he'll be out for the rest of the season. But he's only a junior, and he should be 
ready to return next year, we certainly hope. Here's a ball off the fingertips of uh, Juniata, and UD will go on the offense for the first time tonight. As John Laskowski, who has been the quarterback all year of this ball club and has really played an outstanding season. Here's Carl looking for three to start things off. Just off the mark a little bit. Returned by Jesse Painter. No good. Return shot by Painter. Blocked away. Shadel picks it up. Outside here for John Laskowski. John will step up looking for two. In and out. It's spun. No good. Rebound comes down here to Juniata. And back with it comes that uh, number 11. We'll pick up these guys here in just a moment. 21 from outside looking for three. No good. Return shot. No good. And uh, let's see. Rebound there to uh, Shadel who saves it inbound quickly here for Laskowski back here for David. David uh, Carl puts a shot up, no good. Rebound comes down here to Wegner for two, it's good. So Chad Wegner gets the first two points of the ball game and it, Uday leads two nothing. 13 is Lauver, 11 back here. We'll get these guys here in just a moment. 11 is Bench, so this is Lauver with it. Swinging it across the court over here for that 21 guy. Push it back here for Bench. going to circle around the right side. Passes one over here for 21. Another bounce pass over this way as the Trojans have them really stymied. They can't work inside. Here's the big guy. Puts a shot up. No good. Rebound tipped around in there. Who's got it? It's going to be tipped back inside here. A lot of bounds off UD. 52 is Kreider. And 21 is Deal. This is Kreider with it. Near wing over here they go. Shot from outside for three. In and out, it spun, no good. Kreider with the rebound. Shot wouldn't go in. Return shot from underneath. Blocked away and back with it. Nope, picked up in there by the uh, Juniata. This is Leskowski with it. Now let's see if Jun can get it up court as these Indians have been all over these guys. Here's Wagner, or uh, a shot by Wagner this time. It's good. So Chad Wagner's got four points in the ball game, and the Trojans lead 4 nothing. So it's Wagner 4 and uh, Juniata nothing. Here's a shot by Kreider. He's fouled. The shot did not go down, but he will go to the line shooting two. Jesse Painter, his first, and uh, Kreider at the line shooting the first of two. First shot, good. 4-1. 5.38 left here in the uh, first quarter. And Kreider's second shot. Oh, my. Faked everybody out. Hold everybody for the lane violation by nine people. Who are they going to? Oh, they're going to call that one. No, they're going to say it was on Judiana. Everybody. <laughs> Kreider kind of fake pumped that one from the foul line. He had everybody leading in. <laughs> But he called it against Judy Addison. So they were in there first, so uh, goodness. Everybody collapsed inside. They're all looking around, what, what happened to the ball? <laughs> here's a pass back outside for uh, Shadle for three. No good, and the rebound comes right down here to that uh, Deal. Deal picking it up, and Deal will still have it. Over here, he goes into Beward. Beward back outside for Deal. Deal takes it inside, 12-foot shot off the glass, no good, rebound in there to that Jesse Painter. Jess has played well most of the year, for sure. Here's Carl for two, no good, rebound on the far side, gonna be, let's see, knocked out of there off the uh, body of uh, Deal, and it will stay UD ball very alertly, Aaron making a good inbound save there. Shadle, back here for Laskowski, looking for three. Ooh, just off the mark. Ball on the far side for Painter. And wait a minute, Jess walked with it. Hold everything, Jess walked with it. In the meantime, John Laskowski fires one up from outside. That was nothing but net, but it didn't count. Anyway, 4-1. Uh, Come on. Bench over there for uh, pass inside Beward. Near wing it goes, shot from the side. No good, rebound comes right down there to Laskowski. John coming back with a nice bounce pass for Wagner for t or for uh, Carl for two. David Carl getting a pair. A nice pass there from John Laskowski to Dave Carl. Here's a pass inside. Beward turn around shot in and out. No good. Rebounded David Carl ahead for John Laskowski. John Laskowski stopping, dropping it over here for Shadel inside there. It's Painter for two. Whoa, 
wouldn't go. Rebound comes down there to Lauver. And Lauver coming up the court with it for Juniata. Into the corner. Here is Bench. Inside for Kreider. Kreider on the baseline. Tries to roll it across, but it goes off. Wagner. And out of bounds, it will be Juniata inbounding. Robertson getting set to come into the ball game. He'll replace Aaron Shadel. Aaron has done well here in the first couple of minutes of the ball game. And Brian Robertson in there now. There's Kreider. Push it over here for Bent. Or for Lauber, rather. Shot by Kreider. Blocked away by Jesse Painter. Another block by Painter. B-word with it. He spins inside. Puts a shot of it in. Good. So two good blocks in there by that Jess Painter. And then B-word made the shot anyway. It's 6-3. UD by three. John Leskowski coming back here. Over there for Robertson. This is Dave looking for three. In, nope, wouldn't go. Rebound right there for that uh, deal. And a foul call. The foul will be on uh, Hollis, who was in there. No, no foul. Just blocked out of there. No foul. Here's Robertson. Brian working it around. Near wing over here. He comes to Carl. Dave back out there for John Laskowski. John will fire right underneath there for Wagner. Wagner turn around, shot off the glass. No good. David Carl for two. It's good. Dave Carl with a beautiful move in the paint from six feet outside. And Dave's got two more. Here's Hollis. Near wing over here for that uh, 21 deal. His shot wouldn't go. Rebound coming back here. It's going to be controlled by Hollis. Get it back. Get it back. Hollis still in control. Goes all the way over in the corner with it for Deal. Deal with Wagner on him. Back over here for Hollis. Hollis looking for three. It's good. Hollis has a three-bagger, and it's a 8-6 ball game as Hollis hits a three for Juniata. And back come the Trojans. John Leskowski's going to call out play number four for Robertson. Inside here for Carl. Carl pushes it back out here for Leskowski. This Leskowski, a jumper from 18 feet out, no good. Return shot right underneath there by Robertson is good. Brian Robertson with the bucket following the shot up very nicely. Got the rebound, put it home. Kreider lost it, pushes it over here for Deal. Deal looking for two, it's good. Deal gets two back, it's 10-8. Minute 53 left in the uh, first quarter. Here's Leskowski bouncing it over here for Carl. Out front here for Robertson, swinging it on the wing for John Leskowski. Now on the baseline it goes. Here's a shot partially blocked away, and the ball comes down here to that uh, Lauver. Lauver starting it back quickly ahead here for Beward. Beward puts a shot up, but it's blocked out of there nicely as Brian Robertson got all ball that time and just tapped it out of there. Good job, Brian. And... Uh, Deal will inbound the ball. He pushes it back here now. And uh, Hollis with it. Ooh, near steal there. 13 with a shot for three. No good. On the rebound. Let's see. It's going to be, well, tipped around in there. And finally, shot put up there and missed. And uh, on the ensuing uh, chase of the ball. It's going to be Deal picking up the foul for Juniata. Number 44, Schellenberger into the ball game for Juniata. Has been in there for the last play or two. Here is Laskowski. Dumping it here for Painter. Jess for John Laskowski. John on the baseline. Dumping it here for Wagner. Back to uh, Carl. David pushes it here for Brian. For two. It's good. Well... Okay. Brian for two. Nice job that time. Here's a shot from the side. He's looking for three. That's no good. And on the rebound, it's going to be B. Ward putting a shot up, but he's fouled. B. Ward will go to the line to, the, to shoot two. B. Ward shooting two and made them both. It's 12-10. Todd Travis into the ball game for UD at this point. Shot over here, or the pass over here now and back outside for Laskowski. Oh, 
and five seconds will expire as John Laskowski tried to set something up, but took the five seconds and he didn't get any help in there. No one breaking out to get a pass from John, so they call him on the five second delay. Here's a shot for two by Deal is good. It's tied up at 12 with 12 seconds left. Clock coming down here now. Down to seven seconds, six. Laskowski pushing over here. Carl for three. A little bit long. On the rebound, it's going to come down here for B or for a Deal, rather. And that did it. So we've got a ball game going on here at the end of one. It's the Trojans, 12. The Juniata Indians, 12. If you come in late, you didn't miss a thing. Rice, number 31, into the ball game. He gives the ball to Hollis here. Rice will be on the right wing side, but they go over in the left side there for that uh, bench. This is Rice. Has the ball stolen away from him, but he picked it back up again. And again, it's stolen away. This time it's going to be Aaron Shadel with it. He'll push it back over here for Laskowski. On the wing. Now John circling around out in front. 12-12 ball game. Over here is uh, Shadel looking to drive it inside. Passes it back out here for Carl. He'll dump it over here for a uh, shot by Wagner. No good. And a rebound to Rice. He fires it ahead here now, and coming down with it is that uh, Hollis for two. It's good. So Hollis gets two back for the Indians and gives the Indians a two-point lead. Now it's 14-12, Juniata. Here comes Leskowski for Shadel. Now here for Carl. Now John for two. It's good. John Leskowski ties it back up with an 18-footer. Nice shot. And here comes a uh, pass for Rice. Back outside. Oh, this is Rice. Inside they go with it for Kreider. And he's going to have the ball go out of bounds off the uh, hands of Hollis as Chad Wegner fired it back in there and uh, hit uh, Hollis with it. Went out of bounds off him. 14-14 tie. John Laskowski. Near side over here for Carl for three. That's a little long. A little short and goes long on the far side. And back with it comes Hollis. Pushes it quickly up here now for that, uh, well, Hollis again. Shot good for two. 16-14. Juniata by two. Here's Leskowski driving it inside. Looking for two, but he's fouled. And he will be shooting too, I do believe. John the line shooting two makes his first one. 16-15. He'll shoot one more to tie up the ball game if he can. And he did. All right, 16 all. Rice getting ready to inbound it does so for bench. Bench circles down the left side, has some trouble with it, and they're going to call a foul. They're going to say the foul was on John Leskowski. He'll pick up his first, I believe. For Hollis. Hollis in the corner there for Rice. Rice, wait a minute, a walk. Got to be called on Rice as he got tangled up over there. Wegner defending on him, and a uh, walk was called. Here comes Laskowski back for UD. Calling play number two. He'll push it there for Wagner. Wagner inside. He tries to go with it. The wall comes loose. Picked up by Juniata. Here's a pass over here for Bench for two. He puts the shot up, but a foul call on John Laskowski. John will pick up his second. And Bench will go to the foul line shooting two. Bench made his first one. And he'll put the second one up and not in. 17 16, the uh, Indians by one. There's a nice pass inside for uh, two shots by Carl, the second one of which goes in. Good boy, Dave. Ball stole away by Leskowski. Bounce pass over here for Carl for two. It's good. Good bounce pass. John Leskowski to David Carl. And uh, quickly, the Trojans back you on top by three. Here's Kreider for two. No good. Rebound tipped around and air controlled by uh, Carl here. David will take it all the way in, but he's fouled. And whether he'll be shooting or not, I don't believe. 
Aaron Shadle checks back out as uh, Robertson back in there for UD. This is Brian with it. For Laskowski in front. Near side over here for David Carl on the baseline for two. Rolled in and out, no good. And on a rebound, Dave Carl will pick up the personal foul. All right, come on, get back on Dave. I was on Dave his first. Here's Deal. Over there for Kreider. Kreider walked with it again as he got started up there. And he's called for the walk. 441 left in the first half. John Laskowski, Trojans with a three-point lead, 2017. Here's Robertson in front here for David Carl. Over there for Brian Robertson. Inside, they spin it nicely for Painter for two. No good. Rebound comes down there. And coming away with it is that uh, 13 over in the corner. Shot by Beward. No good. Rebound tipped around inside there. Controlled by Deal. Deal turn around. Shot short. Rebound. Let's see. He's got to go out of bounds. Off UD. There's the inbound pass. Tipped away but picked up by Beward. And then he'll walk with it as he got tied up inside there. And he's called for the walk. And back comes UD. Four minutes and three seconds. And the clock moving under four minutes right uh, now. Remaining here in the half. Robertson here for Carl. David from outside. It's good for three. David Carl with a 22-footer. Buried that one. And it's now 23-17. It's a quick pass ahead for Beward. He shot it over everything. Rebound inside there. Comes down to that uh, 44 uh, Schellenberger and he put it home 23-19 there's a pass blocked away picked up by Beward Beward with a quick pass ahead here now for uh, Lauver he puts a shot up no good and on the rebound we've got a foul called underneath Painter picked up his third personal and the ball comes back over here now and Taking it inside there is a uh, shot by Beward for two. 23-21, the Trojan margin back to two. 3.05 left in the first half. It's going to be a close ball game all the way, the way it looks. Pass put out in front, no good. Re uh, Beward with the ball back here for that Lauver. Lauver will take it inside, spins it over to wing. Shot from the side for three by uh, Hollis is good. That's his second three. And it's now 24-23. All of a sudden, that uh, lead the Trojans had has disappeared, and the Indians with a one-point lead. Robertson for Carl. David pushing it back out here for John Laskowski. John's shot wouldn't go down, and on the rebound, it's going to be controlled in there by Beward. Back here for that uh, Lauver. And Lauver spins it on the near wing over here. Shot from the side for three is good. And that is that Hollis. So Hollis is the pure three-point shooter. That's three of them he's got. And his team has a lead 27, 23. They lead by four, 213 remaining here in the first half. Uh, Hollis is really making a difference out there with those long three-pointers. Okay, the Trojan timeout is over. Now they trail by four. They've got to get back into this one. And here is Shadle for uh, Laskowski. Back out here for two from uh, Carl. Wouldn't go. Rebound inside there to Kreider. And working it back up court is Deal. Deal fires it here for Beward, but it's loose from him. And John Laskowski coming back with it. Laskowski near wing over here for Robertson. Robertson stops and pops a shot up. It's good. Oh, wait a minute. Beward doesn't believe that one, but gosh, you can see that one playing here. He got him right on the arm. Good call. And uh, Brian Robertson will be at the line shooting one to get three. Brian's shot is no good. Rebound comes down here to Kreider. And ahead they come with it now that Hollis. And Hollis is run over, but no call. Here they go inside with a tip away nicely by Carl. Ahead over it, here it comes to Robertson. Robertson dips it right inside here. Carl looks for two, wouldn't go. Wagner with a rebound, it's good. 
Chad Wagner's got two more. Nice shot. Hanging in there tough underneath the boards. Here's Kreider picking up the basketball. Pushes it inside here, now back outside. Here's a shot from outside by Lauber is good for three. So Juniata playing long ball tonight as Lauber hits a three. And here's Leskowski over into the corner for Shadle. Back here for Robertson. Now back outside, they'll go to Leskowski for three. No good, rebound to Deal. Quickly outletted here, but picked off by Leskowski, and John will throw it away on the near wing over here. So they exchange turnovers, and Deal will inbound the ball for Lauber. Over on the wing for Hollis. Inside, turnaround shot by Deal. No good. Rebound comes down there to Robertson. Robertson working it down the court very quickly. Dumps it right there for Carl. Dave for two. A charge will be called. I guess the bucket was no good either. Foul is going to be on Dave Carl. They're going to call a charge. No bucket. And uh, Deal will inbound the ball for Juniata. David Carl picks up his first, they say, on the board. I'll have to double check that here in a second. Shot by Kreider is no good, and if David had one, he now has two. Because that foul will be on Dave Carl also. That was wrong. John over here is a little slow getting him up on the board, and uh, that was Dave's third personal foul. And so Kreider will go to the line shooting two. His first shot's no good. Here's Kreider's second. It's good. 31-27, uh, Juniata by four. Laskowski coming down with it. Dumping it here for Robertson. Robertson off the glass for two, no good. Gets his own rebound, puts the second try up and in good. Brian Robertson shooting over some tall timber in there that time and put the shot home very nicely. Three seconds remaining here in the half. John Laskowski, this is good if it would go. Nope, no good and that did it. The half comes to an end with the Trojans trailing the Juniata Indians by two, 31-29 Juniata. Okay, the game is underway. I missed 12 seconds. I think it's the first 12 seconds of a varsity ball game I've missed all year, so <laughs> you have to consider that. Uh, anyway, uh, Wagner is at the foul line shooting too. Missed his first one. And here's his second one. It's good. So it's a 31-30 ball game now. Beward had uh, picked up the foul, his second, for uh, Juniata. That's Beward with it now over here for Hollis. Hollis dribbling on the left wing over here. He'll pass it back across, and now inside they go to Beward. Beward for two. No good. Rebound there for David Carl. David had it tipped out of his hands. The ball comes over here to Laskowski. Nice bounce pass over there for Robertson. He tries to dump it inside. Robertson has it back, puts the shot up. No good. Ern Robertson's uh, shot will come down here to that bench. Bench lost the handle on it. Goes out of bounds, and it will stay red, they say. That's going to be Deal inbounding the ball for Juniata, for Beward, back here for Bench. Here for Kreider, near wing over here, it comes to Deal. Deal for two, that's no good. Rebound there for Carl. David Carl with another good rebound for UD. He'll put you ahead here for Laskowski. Across the court it goes, now inside for Painter. Painter for two. Nope, the walk called first. Jess walked on his, he took steps trying to get around to get the shot off, and they called him for a couple of steps. And back here comes Bench. Bench looking for two. No good. On the rebound, it's going to be controlled in there by Kreider. He'll push it over there, and it's stolen away by Robertson. Robertson for Dave Carl. Dave for two. It's good. David Carl has two off the pass from Brian Robertson. And it's 32-31. Now UD moves back up on top. <clears throat> Bench, near wing over here for Hollis. Inside they go to Kreider. Kreider dumps over the wing. Picked off over there by Deal. Near wing over here to Hollis. Hollis for two. It's no good. Rebound there comes down to David Carl again. David with another rebound. It's about three or four this half. Here's Robertson for two. It's good. Nice pass from David Carl to Brian Robertson. And Brian comes down limping for UD. In the meantime, it's over on the wing for a uh, shot for three. It's good. As that number 15, Hollis, gets his fourth third uh, three-bagger. 
34-34, all tied up. Here comes Laskowski back with it. Over there for David Carl. David from outside, he's looking for three. Wouldn't go. Right underneath is Chad Wagner. He'll push a shot up, no good. Rebound comes down to Juniata. Back here for that uh, pass on the baseline. Heward missed the shot. The return shot by uh, Hollis is good. Hollis has got a bunch tonight. And it's 36-34. Here's Leskowski for UD. For Robertson. John on the baseline, looking to hook it up and inside, but it's going to be a foul called instead. Foul will be on bench, and uh, UD will inbound the ball. Into the ball game for uh, Juniata. Here comes David Carl for two. No good. Rebound on the far side to Wegner. He'll fire back outside. Robertson from way out for three. In and out, she scoops. No good. Deal with the rebound. Deal coming back with it. Shoots it back over here for that. Hollis for two. No good. Return by uh, Kreider, however, is good. And it's now 38-34 again. Juniata on top, this time by four. Here's Carl looking to get three of those back. It's a little bit short. Rebound comes back to Laskowski. Judd's going to try for three. It's good. Laskowski with a big three-pointer, and the Trojans trail by one. 38, 37, four minutes and 35 seconds left in the third. That looked like a walk, no call. Back with it comes Laskowski for UD. John stopping it, popping good. John Laskowski has just given the Trojans a lead back. 39, 38, UD. Here comes that uh, Lauver. Lauver tries to go across with it. Ball rolls loose. Still fought for, but picked up over there by Hollis. And he'll roll it all the way across the court in this end and out of bounds. Into the ball game, he'll replace Chad Wegner for UD. Shadle in there along with Laskowski, Robertson, uh, Carl, and Painter. Here's Laskowski taking it to the hoop for two. That's a, lifts it up and in good. Good job. John's got about the last seven points or so for UD. Here comes that lover, pushing it over in the wing. Deal has this shot blocked away by Robertson. His pass blocked away. Over here for Carl for two. It's good. David Carl with a nice bounce pass from uh, Laskowski. And timeout called by Juniata as the Trojans have come roaring back here to take a five-point lead themselves. So... This ball game, he's going up and down and up and down. Right now, we're up. 43-38, up by five. Okay, Junior out of timeout over. And back they come with the basketball. Swinging it here for that Hollis. Hollis takes it inside. Drops it over to wing here for Beward. Beward back inside there for that uh, Rice. But it goes off his hands and out of bounds. And it will be UD ball. Here comes John Leskowski. Over on the wing for Shadle. Shadle looking for three, two. All right, they gave Aaron two, but a nice bucket from way outside there. He must have been 19 and a half feet out that time. Here comes that Hollis looking for three more. No good. Big rebound in there by Robertson. And I got to say he walked with it as Brian came down and he'll get called for the walk. And it will be Deal inbounding the ball for Juniata. For Rice. Back outside it comes. Here's uh, Lauber. Has it stripped out of his hands. Picks it back up. Lost the handle again. Ball still loose. Picked up by Deal. His shot partially blocked. And out of bounds. It's going to go off Juniata. It'll be UD ball. 45-38. UD by seven now. And here comes Laskowski, but we can't rest because we've led by seven before. And only to see those Juniata Indians come roaring back. Pass inside, picked up by <laughs> Painter as that ball went off a couple of heads. And finally, Jesse Painter inside to pick it up. Here's a quick pass down here on the baseline. Robertson with the steal, then he stepped out of bounds with it, they say. And Brian stepped on the end line, and it will be Juniata inbounding the ball. This is Deal. Back here for a pass knocked away. Laskowski had a hand on it. Here's a pass back out here. It's going to be knocked out of bounds. Off Juniata. John Laskowski probably should have taken that one himself. He tried to go across to uh, Dave Carl. 
And that allowed Juniata to get a hand on it. <clears throat> Schellenberger back into the ball game for Juniata. Here's Dave for three. No good. Rebound on the near wing. Here goes off the uh, Trojans. Looked more to me like it went off Rice here, but uh, they say not. So 23 into the ball game for Juniata. We'll pick up that young fellow here in just a second. This is that Lauver. Back here for uh, Beward. Lauver looking for three. No good. Rebound comes down here. Beward's got it. He goes for two. Wouldn't go. And on the rebound, it's going to be Robertson coming back with it for UD. Pushing it ahead here for John Leskowski. John over on the left wing. We'll circle around out in front now and see if he can set something up. Over in the wing there for Shadel, and they're going to say Shadel walked with it. Fifth, or minute 48 seconds left here in the third period. Here's a pass inside nicely for Beward. He missed the shot. Return shot by Schellenberger was blocked away, and out of bounds it goes. They say off Beward, and it will be UD inbounding Leskowski inbounding here. 135 left in the third. Laskowski coming down the court. John pushing it here for Robertson. He leans inside, puts a shot up and in. Good for two. Brian Robertson getting himself some room and put the shot up there for two. Nice job by that sophomore, Brian Robertson. Here's Beward looking for three. No good. Rebound here for Leskowski. Leskowski breaking back two on two, so he'll hold it up. Gets it back over here for Shadel for two. No good. And the rebound comes down here to Rice. And Rice will push it here now for that uh, Lover. Lover with some trouble. Shadel after him. Pushes it over there for Rice. Rice for two. No good, but a foul's called. And Rice will go to the line shooting two. Foul will be on Robertson. And uh, Rice will be at the line shooting two. Robertson picked up his first personal foul. And Rice at the line shooting two. Put the first one off the front of the rim. No good. Here's Rice. Second shot. It's good. 47-39. UD hustles it up quickly here for Laskowski. He's looking for three. That's off to the left. Rebound right there, however, by David Carl is good. Okay, right off to Dave, and Dave was able to pop her home. Hey, one of the Mid-State's uh, mid leading scorers. He's in the top ten. In fact, he might be in the top five. Here's Rice dumping it underneath. Outside comes a fellow looking for three. No good. Rebound shot by Rice is good. So Rice has got two. It's 49-41. 19 seconds, 18, 17, so forth. Remaining here in the third. Laskowski taking it down here now. Pushes a shot up. No good. The eight seconds remaining. Here comes Beward. He'll drop it back. Out here they push it over in the corner. Here's that three-point attempt. No good. And the ball's going to go out of bounds on the rebound. And so UD now has regained the lead here to the tune of a eight-point margin. It's 49-41 Upper Dolphin at the end of three. Okay, final period coming up. Trojans need to hang on to an eight-point uh, lead here as uh, this man here has been very instrumental in cutting those leads. Schellenberger tries to go inside. Painter with it for UD on the steal. Quickly back over here comes to Carl. Carl tries to pass it underneath. Picked up in there by B. Ward and back comes that uh, Hollis with it. He pushes a shot underneath that for an alley-oop. Shot taken in there by Rice. Wouldn't go. Ball still controlled by Rice. He loops it up. Wouldn't go in. Another shot tapped up there. No good. And this one's going to go out of bounds into the stands. And it's going to be uh, UD ball, I think. No, they're going to say it went out of bounds off the... There's a little discussion here as to who has the ball. And it's going to be uh, UD inbounding the ball here. That was really tough. Tough to see who the heck had that one, but uh, no argument from Juniata, so apparently it was the right call. Here's Robertson. Back outside here for Carl. David pushes it over in the wing. Back out here for Laskowski. Laskowski over there for Dave Carl. Dave will go in the baseline, and it's going to go out of bounds. It will be UD ball, or rather Juniata ball. <coughs> Here comes Lauver. Lauver takes it inside. Now dumps it here for that B-word outside. Spinning it there for Rice. Rice stopping and popping. No good, but a foul called. 
Foul will be on Robertson, I believe, and Rice might be going to the line to shoot two. He is. Brian picked up personal foul number two. Okay, Rice missed his first one. And here's his second try. It's good. 49-42, seven-point ball game. Shadle coming up the court with it here for UD. Tries to go across with it, blocked away. Beward picks it up here for Deal, who is back into the ball game for Juniata. And Deal picks it up, pushes it over there for that lover. Inside he goes with a turnaround shot by Beward, no good. Return shot by Schellenberger is no good, but he's fouled. Foul will be on Shadle. And Schellenberger to the line for Juniata, shooting two. Shadle will check out of the ball game for UD now as Chad Wagner, number 32, replaces Aaron. And Schellenberg at the line shooting the first of his two. He's got the first one. Good. Schellenberger's second shot is in and out. No good. And on the rebound, we're going to have a foul call on Rice, who went over the back of Dave uh, Carl to get the uh, rebound. And it's going to be uh, Robertson inbounding the ball for UD. Here comes Wagner with a quick pass over there for uh, another dump inside for Painter for two. It's good. Wagner to Carl. David Carl with a bounce pass to Jesse Painter for two. 51 43, eight point ball game. UD on top. This is Lava working it down the right wing side. All the way underneath, he takes it. Pushing it there for that uh, B Ward. No good. And on the rebound, it's going to be Painter with it. Losing it away. And a shot and a foul. Foul will be on Jesse Painter. And to the foul line goes Rice, shooting two. Up his fourth personal foul. He'll have to check out now with six minutes remaining in the ball game. Bad foul for Jess. And Rice at the line, shooting two. His first one. Mm. Oh, good. Still 51-43. And the second shot by Rice is good. 51-44. <clears throat> Here comes Shadel down the left side. He's fouled. Rice will pick up the foul there as he reached in and held the arm. UD will inbound. Picked up his third. Laskowski with the basketball. 6.08. And the clock moving. That's remaining in the game. Here's Robertson. Dumping it inside here for a shot by David Carl. It's good. David Carl with a nice maneuver in the paint. Gets two more. Good job. Here's Deal for three. It's good. So Deal comes back and gets three back for Juniata. Quick pass up here. It's got to go out of bounds. Wow. Kid here trying to make that steal really went hard to the boards. That's that Lauer fella. He's okay. Laskowski coming back for UD. 53-47. Here's Robertson for two. It's good. Brian Robertson with a nice bucket from the left uh, baseline over there. And here comes that lover for Juniata. Dumping it inside here for Beward. He lost the handle on it. The ball comes down here to Laskowski, and Judd's going to lose the ball out of bounds. And... Uh, Rice will inbound the ball for Juniata. Here's Deal. Deal takes it inside. And a foul's going to be called on Aaron Shadle. Aaron, they say, reached in. And he'll pick up the foul. Shadle picks up his second. And on the inbound pass, it's going to go out of bounds off UD. No, off. Uh, okay, it went off. Actually, it went off uh, Juniata. Here is Leskowski. Near wing over here for Robertson. Inside they go to Carl. Back outside for Brian. Brian will push it out here for John Leskowski. John pushing right underneath with a nice pass for David Carl. Boy, he threaded the needle on that one. And Dave put her home. Good pass. Come on, man. Come on. Here's that deal here for Lauver. Lauver, 16 foot pass. It was inside, it goes, and the shot's no good. And back comes Leskowski. 
John pushing it up on the wing over there for Dave Carl. David for three, no good. And on the rebound, it comes down to Beward who pushes it ahead here for Lauber. And then for that Schellenberger. Schellenberger's pass is picked up over there and they're gonna call something before the shot. Have something before the shot. Might be on Shadel, I believe. And uh, Ryan or Aaron Shadel will pick up his third. It'll be Deal inbounding the ball for Juniata. He loops it in here for Glover. Inside turnaround shot by Rice. Good. 57, 49. UD by eight. 408 left here in the ball game. Here's Leskowski trying to do something with it for Shadel on the wing. Shadel in front for John Leskowski. John calls out play three. They bounce it here for Robertson. Robertson looking for two. No good. Rebound tipped around in there. Let's see who's got it. It's going to be Deal coming up with it for Juniata. Pushing it over here for Lauer. Lauer inside. Tries to go underneath there for Beward, but it's knocked away. Coming back with it is UD's uh, Laskowski for two. It's good. John Laskowski putting two more in. It's 59-49. And the ball rolls loose. Be smart now. Let's go, White. Come on. Lauer going all the way underneath with it. Fires it off Rice's knee and out of bounds it goes. And timeout's going to be called by Juniata with the score. The UDA 59, the Juniata Indians 49. 318 remaining in our ballgame. Okay, the Juniata timeout's over. UD with the ball. <clears throat> John Leskowski swinging it over here for Shadel. Inside they go for Wagner. Wagner has it roll loose and uh, back with it comes that uh, Hollis for Juniata. He's in there to shoot some threes, I'm sure. Over to the corner it goes. Lauver shoots it off the side of the bucket. No good and a foul will be called. A foul is on Lauver. And uh, he will pick up the foul. Got a sub coming in. It's going to be Bench returning to the ball game for Juniata, he'll replace Lover. David Carl will inbound the ball for UD. 2.56 left in the ball game. Here's Laskowski. John calls on play number four. Over here for Robertson. Now Laskowski in front. John's got it, takes it inside, looking for two, a little bit short. Rebound there for Bench. Quickly ahead here for that Hollis. Over there, it goes on the baseline. Shot from over there by Deal, wouldn't go. Uh, Shadle with the rebound. Shadle's got it back again. Shadle's gonna be hammered by 31 out here. Rice will pick up the foul. And Aaron may be shooting. Is this a one and one or not? No, I guess not. Not yet. Laskowski to inbound. Robertson back here for Sh Carl. Now Shadle. Shadle for a couple. No good. Rebound to Beward. And deal with it. Over there for Bench. Over in the wing it goes. Bench near side over here for Deal. They'll spin it over there for three point or a two point shot from the line. No good. The return shot by Rice is good. 59 51 with 152 left in the game. There's Leskowski dribbling all the way down, looking for two, wouldn't go. Rice with a rebound. Quick outlet pass up here for Hollis. Hollis for two, wouldn't go. Rebound there to uh, Wagner. Back for Carl. Carl in the near wing. Robertson for two, no good. Rebound comes down there to Rice, and he's fouled. The foul will be on Robertson. And that puts Juniata into the one and one. And Rice will go to the line shooting a one and one for the Juniata Indians. Chad uh, Wagner checks out of the ball game. Jesse Painter playing with four fouls on him will come in for the final minute and a half of the ball game. Rice shooting this one and one, his first shot. 
is no good. Rebound going to be controlled by Leskowski. Coming back with it is John. Quickly ahead here for Shadle. Shadle tries to go across the court with it. Saved from going out of bounds by Robertson. And back here now for Leskowski. John's reached into by Hollis. Hollis will pick up the foul. And Leskowski will go to the line shooting a one and one, I believe. Yep, John to the line to shoot a one and one. John's first shot uh, wouldn't go down, and we've got a foul called on the shot. I was on David Carl on the rebound, and uh, Beward will go to the line shooting a one and one. First shot, no good. Rebound comes down here, and a turnaround shot by Rice is good. 59 53. Here's Shadle with it. Fire good over there for Leskowski. Jun's got it, and timeout's going to be called by uh, UDA with just 108 left in a six point ball game. Now 59 53. The Indians sneak it up on us here. We'll be right back. That's Ellie Miller gesturing there. She is the mother of all these Ellie's angels over here. <laughs> these beauties along the bench over here, and they all belong to Ellie. She considers them her kids. She has done one heck of a job with them all year long. Meantime, we got a minute and eight seconds to play here, and it should be rather exciting as Robertson will get ready to inbound the ball for UD. Trojans leading by six. Here's a quick outlet here for uh, Carl. Carl puts the shot up. It's good. He is fouled. The foul will be on Hollis. And uh, David Carl will go to the foul line shooting one to get three. They gave him the bucket. It was a great running play by Dave Carl off the inbound pass from John Leskowski, I think it was. And here's Dave's one shot. It's good. Well, that makes it a different complexion already. Now it's a nine-point ball game instead of six. And over in the wing it goes. Here's a shot by Deal for three. No good. Rebound here to Shadle. Aaron's triple team, but gets it ahead here for John Leskowski. Leskowski will dump it in there for David Carl, but out of bounds it goes. And Coach Foster very irate about that play. And back comes... Juniata picking up the ball with less than 50 seconds remaining in the ball game. Young fella steps up, puts the shot up, no good. Rebound here to Shadle. Blocked away but picked up by UD. This is Robertson, and Robertson is grabbed over there uh, by B. Ward, and Brian will go to the Lions shooting a one and one. Here's Robertson. His first shot short. Rebound comes right back here, and Robertson has it, and he's going to be grabbed again. He'll go to the line to shoot another one and one <laughs> So let's see if Brian can do a little better on this one. He just shot it up, missed it, was fouled. I'll get another chance. Clock down to 37.3 seconds, and Brian can open up a 10-point lead if he makes his first one. And he did. 63-53. Mike Kissinger into the ball game to replace Aaron Shadle for UDA. So uh, Mighty Mike in here. And getting off the bench is that Todd Travitz. In this arena time, Robertson makes his second shot. Makes it a 11-point ball game now. And Travitz will check into the ball game. He'll replace Jess Painter. So Jess is going to go out here having another fine ball game. And uh, 37 seconds left. UD by 11. There's a shot from the wing. That's long. And the rebound comes down to Robertson. And Robertson has the ball tapped ahead here for Kissinger. Over here for a shot by Travitz. No good. Return shot pushed up there by, let's see, by both Robertson and uh, Carl. I'm not sure who pushed that one up. Anyway, he went out of bounds off the shot. And back with it comes uh, Lauber. Inside he goes with it, but the ball is loose. Picked up in there by Travitz. Travitz back here for John Leskowski. Leskowski pushes ahead quickly here for Kissinger. Inside for Travitz. Travitz for two, no good. Return shot by Robertson, wouldn't go. Return shot by Robertson, blocked. Here's Carl looking for two, it's good. <laughs> Carl slams it off the boards for two, and that's going to do it as the buzzer ends the ball game. Final score, 
UDA 66 and the uh, Indians of Juniata 53. Tough ball game tonight, though. Juniata, got to give them a lot of credit. They really hung in there against the Trojans, and the Trojans need a lot of credit, too, playing now without the services of Sean Rao tonight and doing very well indeed to come up with a big win here over these Juniata Indians. They played them tough, and the Trojans prevailed. There's only a six-point differential at uh, halftime and ends up a 13-point victory. So good job. Uh, good luck. Keep it up. And we'll catch you at the next UDA varsity basketball game. Good night from uh, UDA.